Hello everyone, and welcome to the Adventures of Dan in London. Ba -ba 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 this one, of course, is my greatest adventure of all. The project. The basic goal of our project is to revamp slash improve the recycling practices in the Croydon Council. So, Croydon is one of the 32 boroughs of London. And in Croydon, recycling is compulsory for citizens of the borough. However, there are no compulsory regulations within the council itself. So, recycling isn't required, it isn't mandated within the council. And, frankly, the current recycling practices are not really that great. So we've laid out our project in five basic objectives. Objective 1. Identify best practices for recycling in the offices. This includes things like doing background research as well as interviewing office recycling experts. So we did plenty of research during the last term and we're doing even more research now. And another thing that we're doing during this term is we're going around to different boroughs and different authorities to see what has succeeded for them in terms of recycling practices, getting their employees to recycle more and just have more knowledge about the whole thing. Objective 2. Clarify plans, policies, and guidelines for a current in-house recycling program. This includes researching in-house Croydon documents, as well as interviewing key, current, and former staff. So for example, there used to be a network of recycling champions, and it was their job to um, be informed about how to recycle, be informed particularly about how to recycle in the building so that they could tell people how to recycle and then the knowledge would be moving around and having more knowledge, recycling being more visible, the recycling program would be better. Objective 3. Conduct a baseline assessment of Croydon's in-house recycling program. This includes doing more background research and documenting the destination of waste. It's similar to Objective 2, but it's not the same, in that Objective 2 focuses more on what the policies for the employees themselves are, whereas Objective 3 focuses on what the business end of it is, where it all gets collected, where it gets sent, things like that. Objective 4. Evaluate employee opinions about in-house recycling policies. This includes surveying the council employees, interviewing key staff, and forming focus groups with selected staff. So the way we're picking focus groups is with our survey, at the end of the survey, we attached a little thing that said, if you would like to talk to the team further about recycling in the council, please put your information so that we can contact you. So we were expecting like 15, maybe 20 people to say that they wanted to talk to us. We got over 120 people. So yeah, that's, we're, we're gonna, take people in small groups and we're gonna kinda have just small group discussions about recycling and how things can be fixed. And finally, Objective 5. Develop recycling improvement plan based on data from the previous objective. Objective 5. Develop recycling improvement plan based on data from the previous objectives. Nailed it! This one is pretty straightforward. Through the first four objectives, we get a bunch of data that we need and a bunch of suggestions that we can make to our sponsors so that they can implement improved recycling practices in the council. Yeah, that's pretty much it. So that's the core of the project. And really, the only other thing we have to do is we have to write up a report. Tomorrow, we get to shadow operatives from InterServe, which is the company that takes care of the Croydon Council's waste. So that should be interesting. I will tell you all about it tomorrow. Until then, stay tuned. Ba -ba 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 -ba